everybody, my second channel, and I'm back from vacation. And I have some lot of unpacking to do, and that's exactly what I'm gonna do today. Um, pretty much I need to, of course, uh, make up for all the uh, videos I could not actually upload, so we're gonna pretty much do pretty much some unpacking from all the souvenirs I just got, and there are pretty much like various items in Pokemon that I could not get. In uh, in events, so let's just unravel. Like these are just pretty much various events that I am able to do right now because I was able to download them because uh, some campings did not exactly have a very protected. Why uh, uh, that work? And I was able to do the uh, exploit and was able to get some various event Pokemon and items for that. Uh, there are pretty much three events we're gonna do. Pretty much very much three. Uh, there are the spiked. Uh, the Spiked Eared Pikachu, Pichu, uh, the Enigma Stone, and the Unofficial Azure Flute. That's the uh, event we're going to do today. It's pretty much simple. It's a very, very simple uh, thing which you need to do. All you need to do is... Let me actually see what I have because I need Pokeballs. I have seven Great Balls. That's fine. That's fine. Let's see. It's a Pichu! One of its ears is spiky. Hey hey, you should not tamper with the that shrine. People are set to disappear. Pokemon sometimes disappear around the shrine. It's believable that a Pokemon which wanders across time does that. It is a truly, it's a truly strange thing. Well, 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 this must be, this must be the Pichu that lived in this forest for some time. When I saw it for the first time, it looked lonely. It is full of energy today. I see, it seems that these old friends finally meet again after a long time. It wants to join your party. What about joining? Spike, spiky-eared Pichu. Zip zip you! Oh, here it is, young trainer. I will give you this Pokeball. I used it. Uh, I, I used to use them when I was younger. Don't worry, it's still in good condition. Received the Pokeball. It seems that P the spiky-eared Pichu wants to stay in your Pokeball. Spiky-eared Pichu has, jo has joined your party. This Pichu is an electric type with a. Uh, with a static with ability. It's always female, it always has a naughty nature. It's holding a zap plate with, hold, with the moves Helping Hand, Volt Tackle, Swagger, and Pain Split. Into the fact about this Pichu is it can learn moves that it normally cannot. That's the special thing about this uh, Pichu. However, I should be made mention that it cannot evolve into a Pikachu and it cannot be tra transferred to other other games. I will not give them the name because it's special. Being friends we should make it happy. Take good care of it. Uh, I actually want to know what all the moves it can actually learn because apparently this Pichu was exceptionally rare. I don't know, Misty? Uh... It doesn't exactly say anything about the... Uh... Spiky eared Pichu, but apparently it can. Hmm. Also, I should be making mention that that Pichu is not shiny locked. It's the first thing that actually, uh. Uh. It pretty much has, uh. <clears throat> it can. It's supposed to be like learning moves that normally can't, but, uh. Yeah. It can be like, yeah, okay, I need to get pretty much get that out and use fly. And apparently it has some uh, text, some text if you actually talk to uh, Professor L, if you bring that Pichu with you. More than that, it just appears shiny Pichu that gives you a really exceptionally rare Pichu, but this Pichu cannot be transferred over because apparently of some... And they actually do explain the entire game. Can I please get out of here? I don't have any repel because I don't want to use them right now. I just... Level 30 Pichu, they can evolve into a Pichu. I think the thing about that makes sense why Pichu... Uh, 
uh, that both the shiny forms and pe uh, and his regular is that it makes him pretty much get darker when uh, they evolve. All right, so let's bring this Pichu over to Professor Elm and sh uh, give him a little research because he has uh, some matter. Interesting things to say about this Pichu. I put it in front just in case, and it is indeed a neither rare Pichu. You can see also on the, on the back part, it has some uh, text. Hi, Zakon! That's a quite a rare Pichu. Can I take a look at the closer? Hmm, none of its ears are spiky. That's strange. There seems to be something more to it. It is really is a rare sight. You met it at Ilex Forest? A mysterious Pokemon called Celebi has been sighted there, or so I heard. Speaking of that... Uh, Professor Oak once wrote about Celebi and Time Travel in a research paper he presented at a conference. Celebi can use its mystic power called Time Travel to travel to the past and future. If this P2 has traveled through time, perhaps you should take extra care of it, Zeko. It seems that this P2 has been affected by traveling so far through time with Celebi. I'll inform the Pokemon Center of it. Lady at the reception should be able to tell you if anything may affect the Pichu. Alright, so let's actually take this to a Pokemon Center. Maybe we can actually see if... Uh, if we can actually learn a little bit more. Apparently we are going to actually do a lot of research about this one Pichu. Cherry Grove. Hi, welcome. You're a sweet type of would you like to rest? Yeah, it doesn't actually tell you. Okay, so. So it's pretty much, um. So pretty much all of, uh. <clears throat> It's pretty much a rare. It's pretty much a rare Pichu, which just never much. It does can learn nest. It is. It is a rather powerful. It is just a rare. It is a regular Pichu. It's just different with a different, with a different sprite and such. It just. It's a rare Pichu, but cannot be a. Uh, that pretty much traveled through time just because of that. So if it actually needs to be take actually good care of it, it should be. Uh, Interesting fact about this Pichu is that its max Poke Athens spike uh, is that it has five stars in speed uh, and three stars in in uh, uh, in uh, technique, and it has a three full stars of jump while also a fourth star in uh, in jump. So and also has one star, just one simple star. In power, so it is a it is it's pretty much different. I think it's the thing is that is that this Pichu is supposed to be based off uh, a special Pichu. Oh, oh, is he Pikachu? Only only Prince Split can be learned. That's sad to know about that. Anyways, now for the next event, which is the uh, <coughs> the uh, what is it called again? The Enigma Stone, which is a uh, also another rare version of a, uh, which actually is a an item that's also based off in uh, another thing as well. I put this guy up front because Zap Cannon, and I know what I'm going to fight. I'm also what else do I need to get? Uh, no 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 no. Gonna be difficult choosing. I'm thinking Latios might also be a good choice. And this thing. It might be a good thing. Um, the Enigma Stone is a rare item, once again, and um, pretty much an event exclusive item that allows you to get a rare a Pokemon that is normally version exclusive to another game. That's pretty much uh, the choices. It's pretty much uh, like in a, a reference to the Eon ticket because uh, in, because you get Latios in uh, you pretty much become a fight against Latios, I'm just simply say that now. Um, pretty much take the Enigma Stone to Steven. 
People who in de they dedicate themselves to what they believe stand out in the crowd, but my passion is no less than yours. Well, the matter of the thing you have there. The stone, it's so mysterious. Something seems to be missing shining inside. The stone is modest, yet hiding something wonderful. Do you have a study by experts? I don't need enigma stone to the research. I will check. Can you hold on a moment, one second? Thank you for your patience, it took me a little while, but I have confirmed that this is an orb that contains what is called the Soul Dew. Obtain the Soul Dew. Soul Dew is said to be the solidified spirits of Latias and Latios. It has the power to bring out the true potential of Latias and Latios. The spirits of these Pokemon and the Soul Dew are said to call out to each other. The thing that puzzles me is this place the soul do with us found. Why can't I? It seems that Latias became attracted to it in no time. I can feel that Latias is full of fighting spirits. I would like to challenge it, but I will let you go for it. Yes, pretty much this is a chance for you to get the other versions of uh, legendary Pokemon should you wish to do this. Um, this is pretty much like a reference to the Ian Tick where you get a roaming Pokemon in the uh, old Latios and Latias Latios in Heart in uh, Soul Silver and Latias in, uh, in Heart Gold, where you get the other through an event exclusive item. Which is pretty much this case. And you you roam that you get a roaming while the other one just simply fights you. So I have to fight against Latias right here. Huh? That doesn't matter. That doesn't matter right now because we're gonna battle fight Latias. Latias appeared. Latias, Psychic Dragon type. Levitate for its ability with Water Sport, Refresh, Mist Ball, and Zen Headbutt. Um, if this was a hard goal, you fight against Latias here, Psychic Dragon type. Uh, levitate for its ability, holding nothing. Uh, protect, Refresh, Lost Support, and Zen Headbutt. If you want to know how Latias is as a Pokemon, it is a rather powerful special wall with some good stats to uh, back. Uh, I just realized something. I did save, I did save, right? I did save, right? I forgot about something important. <laughs> I forgot about something important. I only have three Great Balls. How could I fight a Latias in that condition? That's not, not important. That's uh, impossible for me. I just know just know that Latias is of course has has great special defense and also decent special attack, kind of fast as well. Um, also pretty fast as well. So that's pretty, pretty much the special the defensive counterpart to Latio to Latios. That's all uh, it's gonna be said. Okay, I was right in front of it, but I need to buy some Pokeballs because I'm an idiot. Fucking god. Because a big dum dum that I am, I need to get more ultra balls because I have to do that. Uh. Now I can fight it with no problems. <sighs> Me being a big dummy with my brain hole. Uh. Now let's catch you. Uh. Here we go, zap cannon, and it's fine. Hit. Zap Cannon's effect, uh, took effect. 
Miss Ball is also working its effect. Miss Ball is its signature move. It is a uh, base and 70 power, 100 accurate special psychic type move with additional effect as a 50% of so lowering the target's special effects. Special attack. Yes, yeah, it's not the. Uh, uh, la, 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 yeah. Now let's make sure he doesn't get to. Matthias is the offensive wall and has Luster Purge, which is pretty much the same power, same accurate, but with uh, with uh, with a uh, fifty percent chance of lowering the the, the target's special defense. Elatio is more offensively based than Latias. Huh? Only one HP left. This not just candy becomes shiny, but I want to simply get it right here now. It's gonna be a bit of a problem. It's a she stupid. This the Pokemon can only be female. I'm glad I'm actually able to catch Latias right now. There we go. There's Latias. And that's all the events I can do in the Pokemon uh, Soul Silver. There's still one more event we need to go on. With. Okay. Latias, the Eon Pokemon. Dragon Psychic type. It communicates with using teleport. Its body is covered in down that refracts light to make it invisible. And I finally got my Latias. I'm actually really happy about that. Impressive. It was a great battle. I don't think you had to give everything you got. And that scares me. I've been away from the whole Pokemon League for too long. I'll have to excuse myself. Oh, I never got your name. But I won't ask for it this time. My fun will wait. We'll have to wait for the render for the right time. Yeah. Referencing that there would there was in fact a uh, home region home region remake in the making after this one because there was supposed to be a home remake also in generation 5 however that didn't happen that did not happen until generation 6 came along we will make we will set for which I'm in a whole full bit busy getting the uh, uh, So, only one last rem event remaining, which is the uh, as Azure Flute, which is uh, an item that was never uh, distributed and anywhere in, in, in no game and never anywhere in the world. I just simply got it by accident, and I just and I just could not handle. It. I just simply accepted it. So I will go after the Azure Flute and get uh, what Pokemon you can get from that. The Azure Flute is. A, they say that the Azure Flute was. They call it difficult to use, which is complete bullshit, by the way, because there is a full course a uh, way for you to easily do this. It, it, it's pretty, really screaming out loud how to get this Pokemon to to get the Azure Flute to work. It's rather easy. Um, let me just first see what I want to bring along because the Pokemon I'm going to catch is level 80. You heard me correctly. Uh, uh, Thunderbolt, I'll take that. Uh, I'm also dealing with, with a lot of normal type. I actually want to know, it's level 80, so what it, what move does it have in Diamond Pro? Uh, level 80 it has... Okay, okay. okay. So, to definitely bring Dark and Psychic types with me. That should be my normal one. You with me. Uh, 
earn an HM staff. That's also very neat. I need rock climb and strength. That means I'm gonna steal this with me. Uh, I'll bring you in with me. Actually, I should bring Heatra because he should also bring in a. Uh, yeah, this should be good. This should be good. Let me check Darkrai real quick because I want to make sure. 50, 53, 50. I don't try. Uh, no, because you're also a poison type Pokemon. He has future sights. So Heatra will be my big boy here. Yeah? Uh, yeah, that should be good. 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 That should be my team for today. Even though I'm fighting against Pokemon that's like, like two levels higher than me. Uh, and base 120 across the board. Uh, also taking away the item. Pretty the Yachi Bear, which pretty much lowers. Uh, the first ice side move, which actually pretty much is huge, yeah, I knew that. And I need to buy a lot of Pokeballs. I need to buy a lot of Pokeballs. Um, I have 53 Ultra Balls, but sh I should also buy a lot of Dust Balls, because where we're going is in the considered the cave area. It doesn't make sense, but... I know that the back part of that area where we're going to is... In what the designation is, it has a dark background, so it indicates as a cave. So, some dust spells should be also ideal. I don't have anything. Alright, let's see what I can sell then. Yep, I got some pearls. Alright, I'm gonna use these. I got a red bone. Uh, this should only eat five to them, but it should work. And I also have like a lot of ultra balls. I only have a lot of ultra balls by default. So that should be good. That should be good. That should be good. Um, Dragonite is up front. We have level 50 Pokemon. Here we go to Orbux City. I do know that there is an uh, extra location added in somewhere. It's supposed to be like. Uh, yeah. I mean, let's see what I have in, in repels because I do need to go up a very large mountain in order to get there. Oh, and it doesn't surf. I have a kind of bad surf. Uh, I have a kind of bad surf. I forgot completely about surf. I need serve in order to get there, but I don't have any serving Pokemon, don't I? I use you to serve up there. Yes, I do. Bring a level 20 Pokemon with me. I'm getting rid of you. Let me actually see if I'm at least have an escape rope. I'm fine climbing all the way down. It, I like a mountain corner. I like mountain corner, but too much for that. Alright, so all preparations are set. Alright, so I need to go to Spear Pillar for this event to do. So if you don't know actually how the end to the how the Asher Food looks like, we want to key items. And it's located like right here. A flute that puts out an echoing sound that do not seem to be in the world is unknown who made it. Rather rare item, isn't it? Right, so let's see what we can get. Let's see what we can get. I'm not confident because I'm fighting really underleveled, but I guess it is my best choice. It's I, it's the best I got, and I'm going to best with the best I can do. 
I'm scared. I'm seriously scared to go up here and go all the way to Spear Pillar just to get uh, that rare event. This this is just the scariest thing I'm going to do here, dear. Ugh, I'm seriously scared. At least I know that it doesn't have Parish Song in this moveset. Even though it can learn that. Alright. Because it should be level 90 in order to get Parish Song, but it's level 80. Alright, here comes a long climb up to Mount Cornet, all the way to uh, Spear Pillar. Then I'm going to go with Spear Pillar and Pokemon Diamonds. Oh, here we go. I'm really, really scared of this, but I'm uh, tackling it head on. Alright, we're almost there to our destination. Uh, My mind, my really bad feeling about this. That this is going to be the one of the hellest battles I'm going to do in the entire game. Oh no! I just lost my sack completely, and I'm going to have to deal with a Pokemon not recovers. Now, I recommend you just say right here because that tile we're now standing on, that is a flute tile. And if we stand right in the middle of it, we're going to activate the event. Saving a lot of data. Here we go. Zachrama's Azure Flute is making a sound. Would you like to blow into the Azure Flute? The glowing staircase appeared. We are now in a very new area called the Hall of Origin. Should you step on top of this on this platform, the battle begins. Good freaking luck to anyone who does this with me. No doctor. A wild Arceus appeared! Arceus! I never thought I'd ever say a wild Arceus appeared. Arceus, level 80, normal type. Multi type for its ability with Hyper Beam, Recover, Future Sight, and Refresh. <sighs> if you want to know how Arceus is as a Pokemon, it's your typical mythical Pokemon with a Pokemon with a Primus that. Arceus with a, with a base 100, like a signature and stat all across the board. Arceus has 120 across the board, uh, on all of its stats. On 128 HP, 120 at, uh, attack, 120 defense, you just saw that crazy defense of his, 120 special attack, 120 special defense, and 120 base speed, making it a uh, 120 stat total of uh, of seven seven twenty, which is seven hundred twenty, which is the highest of any regular Pokemon with no form changes ever. So 
We're doing with a very exceptionally powerful Pokemon, well that is no surprise. Multi-type is a very unique ability as well, which causes it to, uh, here we go, it comes to the future side, but it failed. Okay. <clears throat> pretty much all it does, it has, um, pretty much if it has a, it changes the type depending on the health plates. So if it holds like a Draco plate, it becomes a Dragon type, if it holds like a Flame plate, it becomes a Fire type. That, that, that's pretty much, pretty much basic bare bones logic. Arceus, however, also comes with a signature move, which has the same effect. And base 100 power, uh, 100 power, 100 power, 100 power, 100 accurate, special normal type move, which has the same effect as the, uh, as multi-type. Changes your type when depending on the, on the plate it's holding. And this is a Pokemon that also can recover itself, so I will be here for some great some time. Also comes with Hyper Beam as well, so uh, it not only comes with Hyper Beam, but also with Refresh, with Recover and Refresh. So it takes it's gonna take me a long time to even tackle it. This uh, all this awesome Pokemon just down to 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 Orange Hell because it's so strong that I'm having trouble with it. It's God, after all. Moose also, he can learn a lot of, like, a lot of TMs, but not all of them. He can, there are some moves he cannot learn, but... He is, uh, can, but he has the moves that can count, and he just uses hyper for me, so he just simply obliterated me. <sighs> I can only learn, also, only learn Dragon Meteor if he only holds the Dragon, the Draco Plate, so... Make that as you will. I think I'm gonna use Darkrai for this, simply use some notes and simply will down with it, uh, because I'm having to deal with this bullshit right here. With a... with a... Hyper Beam spamming Arceus, and I'm having trouble with it. Especially base 120, only level 30, oh, 30 level higher. Arceus with uh, uh, not exactly a pleasant surprise to get uh, trouble with it. Uh, actually, gonna sacrifice Breezel just simply so I can get. Uh, I think I'm gonna use hypnosis and the combination of hypnosis and dream eater, bad dreams in order to uh, weaken it a little bit further. But it's gonna probably use hyper beam on me or. Something that. I just quick attack, use priority move. Simply take do one damage to Arceus and take take, take, level, take down Breezel. This is future side, of course. Uh, Breezel uses Hyper Beam, but it failed. That's three of them down. Three of five. If he uses all of his Hyper Beams, then I'm kind of safe because the only thing he can then use is. His Refresh, recover himself, and then use future side, which pretty much has 50 HP PP, so... I'm dealing with really... I, for, it's fighting against a really powerful Pokemon. Not, 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 I don't expect it to be an easy fight. And I have to deal with another hyper being coming straight my way. I think, uh, since it can refresh, I sh and no, I should use Heat Fan and use Scary Face units, and also uh, use Trap damage as well. Okay, yeah, it's using Recover, since if it's keep recovering, then I should simply just reel away with the HP like that. And also, Arceus is very fast, so Scary Face might be a good idea while well, I'm pretty much damaging it with, with Fire Spin. Uh, scary face. That will not work, Arceus. He uses at least countless shots of light. It's typed, yeah, that's pretty much the uh, description of uh, judgment. Time, use another scary face. That should do it greatly. Okay, now I can actually wheel it down while it also can use Hyper Beam. And I can simply just use Dark Cry on this. 
Okay, Archie, uh, he trained to survive that. He was free enough. Like, that was not long. Okay, hit him once again. I need to heal up Dark Rabbit right now. Okay, he's dropping the Vortex. He must recharge. I, I of course, not expect this to be an easy fight, but holy. But holy shit, is he being persistent. Because he's doing keep doing that. I don't uh, I mean I'm dealing with a level 80 Arceus. I'm not an Arceus is level 80, so I don't expect it to be an easy fight. Especially considered an option is an optional fight. But I have to do what I can do. Burning it also might be an awful thing. I should have used Thank you! Thank you for using refresh. Thank you for using refresh for me. Return your stat changes to normal, please. That is awesome. Thank you. Thank you, Arceus. I don't want to burn you or whatever. I just simply want to weaken you so far to the point where I can simply capture you. Okay, he's down like that. He's still hurt by flare uh, fire spin, so I think I should now uh, frozen Pokeballs at it. It's gonna be a tough fight. It's gonna be a tough fight. I remember when this. I know the people is actually like, were like, why can Arceus, God of all Pokemon, uh, be captured in a in a uh, Pokeball? What's even Fire Spin? Okay, thank you. Uh, can be caught in a in a Pokeball like that does this make sense? It makes sense since Arceus is still a Pokemon. You are a being, that's his fifth one. There goes uh, his chance to obliterate me. Now all I can do is simply use Future Sight and that's it. So I can simply just simply use uh, Darkrai on this and only, then the only moves he can use to obliterate me is, uh, is Struggle. So Darkrai is gonna be my wall because all of his Hyper Beams are gone. All of his hyper beams are gone. They can use recover, but I can of course use uh, use hypnosis on it. Then I can weaken it down completely with just simply spatial rant and uh, well, it's simply because sleep and all that. Can of course fulfill any role, but it's not. Even I make, should back make a fan of that. Uh, it's in, that, in red health when I deal with this. Like that. Can you please not break out Arceus? Oh, future side, that's good. That means that I'm going to be taking no damage when that thing is going on. Let's use a time ball. It fits him. No, yeah, it's nice and nice and light. So, one, two, three. Yay! Got Arceus! I thought... Oh, that was... <laughs> got Arceus! Yay! That's actually really just focusing on because I already got Arceus uh, registered instead of... To, yeah, yeah, transferred to Mythical instead. Let's read this Pokedex entry. All the way to down. Arceus, the Alpha Pokemon. It is described in mythology as a Pokemon that shape the universe with its 1,000 arms. Um, it is a ref that 1000 arm thing is a re reference to Buddhism. It's supposed to be a uh, Arceus is supposed to be based off like. <clears throat> Sorry, man. yeah, it's but Arceus is supposed to be based off like every senior re religion exists. That's supposed to be the thing, yeah. But many people do make say Lama God, despite this thing is based off a centaur. I think uh, the Hall of Origin, that's where we are right now, uh, disappears if you go in and then go back out. Yeah, it simply goes back to Spear Pillar. I actually want to see all those treasures which I just got, and I need to simply just walk all the way back there. Because I don't have fly. Which is fine, because there is a shortcut. I like that I just I like that I got Arceus in the first tries. 
it was a hellish fight, but uh, I'm apparently the master of fighting against any legendary and mythical Pokemon. That's my stick, and I can and no one can take it away from me. That's my special ability. <laughs> and I went in the wrong way. Thank you, Dark Knight. Thank you for so much for being so handful wall with its future side and you trend really helped well with uh, hyper beams. <laughs> it weighs exactly three hyper beams on pretty much yeah, it mi yeah, I'm gonna say he missed one hyper beam and used for the others on heat and on Dark Cry, Heat and the others. I remember when I went over it because it's been lit quite some time and I had to transfer this footage. Yes, I would like to climb down. Out. And then how do I get there? I've never been in this location ever. But it looks like a stove. This is my only spot. Alright, right here. And there's a rock smashes. Cities also have rock smashes. Okay. I might get an alien from the solid by uh, Jude Jude if I am lucky. If I take left, I should be in Eternal City really quickly. What is this? Found TMO2 Dragon Claw. Okay, I actually want to know what that was, but uh, okay. Let's see what our Arceus is as a po uh, stats will look like because those were pretty because the Arceus gave me a great some time a great some trouble. But uh yeah. Simix Now push this all the way down here. Simply use rock smash on this one and out. Like I said, I'm out. All the way to the city. Alright, let's see what Arceus has for us. It's mythical, so... Alright. Actually, I really am curious about that a lot that, uh, that Arceus will miss. Uh, it's this. Oh, no, it's this one right here. No, it's mine. Modest nature, all of Orchard hates to lose. What is has the modest nature? Oh my lord! Oh. Okay, I need to check out characteristics about hates to lose. All right, game mechanics. Hates to lose. I think that's defense. And that's I think that's really just a let's not look look like in stats right now. Yeah, that's base two hundred and seven defense. Base oh is that special defense? Oh, I don't know. I need to check its characteristics, characteristics, characteristics. Alright, here we go. Uh hates to lose. Part of its power, should be buying. Can't take a hit, I'm curious, trying to win. Hate to lose, okay. So it has base 20, 28 special, maybe base uh, S28. Uh, yeah, so it's special defense. Increases its attack because of, na of uh, its. Uh, because of its uh, modest uh, special attack with, and lowest attack with its. With its uh, with its modest nature, but look, but increases its special defense with its with that uh, with that heat to lose thing. Okay, I um so twenty eight special defense. That's not bad for Arceus. Special that means that I have a special tank. Huh. 
Never thought I would actually say that. I hope you enjoyed this. That I am. Uh, that is um, this. Uh, this video. Next video will be just simply the. Uh, once again, I'm back to my party and we're going to continue on this. So, uh, it was a fun night. It was very fun night with uh, my uh, vacation. Now being completely over. See you guys then.